Not everyone is able to go home during the holiday season. With that in mind, senior leaders from 3rd Armored Brigade Combat Team, 3rd Infantry Division, make sure their soldiers enjoy a special meal with their military families on Fort Benning. In this time of the year, uh, most of the uh, soldiers can't go home because, you know, finance and stuff. So you pretty much get an opportunity to see the chain of command out of the elements, out of the company environment. I think it's very important because, I mean, day in, day out, the soldiers see, you know, the NCO, you know, getting on them, yelling, screaming, uh, pretty much in the work environment. Today is just mostly uh, a laid back day, a relaxing day to see their chain of command, the NCOs, the first sergeants, and our commanders pretty much provide them service uh, on a relaxed atmosphere. Soldiers enjoy a hot meal to include ham, crab legs, mac and cheese and greens, amongst many others. The festive decorations and relaxed environment makes everyone feel right at home. It feels good, you know, um, it shows that, you know, they, they do care and, you know, they're not just there just to sign papers and, you know, sign on statements or whatever. They, you know, they're actually human beings just like everybody else. This event not only provides service to the soldiers enjoying the meal, but gives the leadership the opportunity to see how hard the kitchen staff works every day. Just having other folks, uh, other soldiers from the outside from the company come in to serve, pretty much take a, a break off of us. We can sit back and uh, our soldiers can critique the ones that's not in the food service environment, you know, critique on the service size, how much to serve the soldiers. So it's just pretty much, uh, it's kind of a fun day for us, actually. It's not every day that soldiers get to interact with their leadership this way, and during this time of year makes the experience even more special. Specialist Jordy Matthews, Fort Benning, Georgia. Thank you, sir. Greatest commander ever.